electric uh, property over concatenation we can say okay another is r1 plus r2 into r3 is equal to r1 into r3 plus r2 into r3 so this is a distributive property of uh, concatenation okay these things you can always prove by first going through a language uh, converting it into the language form and proving the proposition okay now another thing is called cl uh, closer property equivalence okay so we have clean closer so i can always say that r1 into r1 star what it will be can you tell me r1 into r1 star is equivalent to r1 star can you tell me why Hmm? Oh. Yeah, it may have empty string. So, yeah. So, how? No, no. That is one case, but R one may not have empty symbols. so the way uh, okay so so uh, i have already told you in the last class what is r1 star so r1 star is nothing but union of i is equal to 0 to infinity l of r1 to the power i understood so so any uh, so it can be l1 so l0 r1 then l1 r1 then l2 r1 like this okay so all these unions okay l of r1 then l2 r1 like this now if i uh, add one more r1 then how it will look like it will be it will just uh, it will just go to uh, an uh, one more times so i will be incremented by one so it will be like so it is from 0 to infinity okay so it will always be uh, so the concatenation will al also be from 0 to infinity so it will be like l of i plus 1 belongs to i can say i is equal to zero, so it will be what l of i plus 1 to the power r1 uh, union i is equal to 0 to infinity understood any doubt so when i'm saying that r into r star what is the language it is uh, representing it is representing l concatenation of union i is equal to 0 to infinity l of i r okay that will be what i can say that union i is equal to 0 to infinity i have only one more concatenation that is l of i plus 1 to r okay so it will be so i will always be 0 to infinity so it will be i can say that Uh, if i put down as j is equal to so i can say it is union of j is equal to 0 to infinity l of j r and hence it is r1 star any problem okay then there is another uh, property that i'll uh, 
leave it to you to prove. So, there is another property called as L star into L star. So, sorry, let me write it down. R1 star into R1 star is also equivalent to R1 star. Okay. Similarly, you, you can prove in that way only. Means uh, you start with the definition. What is the basic definition of uh, R1 star? That is the language accepted by R1, and then you can prove that. I am not uh, making it once more. So, so and another is R1 R2 star into R1 is same as R1 into R2 R1 star. Okay, so this is another th uh, property. We can try that to prove. Okay, so so uh, we'll now start the uh, BPUT question, which has been asked. That is, that the first question was R plus S star is R star plus S star. Okay, prove or disprove. So is it correct or not? Let us try. R plus S star is equal to R star plus S star. Tell me whether it is correct or not. So, it is like prove or disprove. So, it is a two and half mass question. So, so, you do not have to, yeah, so tell me whether it is correct or not. Okay, why? Yeah. So you will start. You will start. You will, so, so you will start like this. So R plus S, L of R plus S, is equal to what? L of R union L of S. Correct. So if you apply the closure property, what will happen? It will be union of so L star, you can say L star R plus S will be either the word will belongs to L star R or it belongs to L star S. Understood? So, hence it is proved that R plus S star is equal to R star plus S star. Okay. It is a simple, a simple uh, proof. It is nothing to, uh, nothing magic about it. So, let us try the second question. If I say RS plus R whole star concatenated by R, whether it is equal to R concatenated by SR plus R star. Tell me. So, first you will apply the basic uh, operations of uh, this thing. So, RS plus R star into R, what it will be? 